to worship. for an altar, ancient but still standing. Do you see it? Tis all that remains of the great altar. We few who travel far call to me and I will come, without mercy, without fear. Cry havoc in the moonlight, let the fire of vengeance burn. The cause is clear, a very old invocation, perfectly translated. Why, thank you. Strange that there wasn't an altar like this at Methal's temple. The temple was a place of justice, but this is different. This was where the elves called to her spoke to her. Then one day she disappeared, and there was no one with whom to speak. Your companions will need to go elsewhere. Not to worry, if there is shouting, they will hear it readily enough. who I am. From high priest to high priest, I am the last to drink of sorrows. Come to Akasmithal. Whatever you are, whatever remains, I invoke your name and your power. Mother. Mother? Now, isn't this a surprise? So this is Mithal. She is a deceiving witch! Now, now, that's quite enough of that. What have you done to me? I have done nothing. You drank from the well of your own volition. Then you are Mithal?
Mithal was the goddess of justice. I've seen the statues. She... Was one of the people. Yes, indeed. I do not understand. How can you be Mithal? Once I was but a woman, crying out in the lonely darkness for justice. And she came to me, a wisp of an ancient being, and she granted me all I wanted and more. I have carried Mithal through the ages ever since, seeking the justice denied to her. Then you carry Mithal inside you. She is a part of me, no more separate than your heart from your chest. You hear the voices of the well, girl. What do they say? They say you speak the truth. But what was Mithal? A legend given name and called a god? Or something more? Truth is not the end, but a beginning. So young and vibrant, you do the people proud and have come far. As for me, I have had many names, but you may call me Flemeth. I know the name Flemeth. My people call you Asha Bellinar, the woman of many years, and speak of your legend. It says long ago you left your husband for a lover. Your husband then tricked you, killed your lover, and imprisoned you. Then a spirit came to offer you vengeance. Mithal, that's what you spoke of. One day someone will summarize the terrible events of your life so quickly. But yes, I was that woman. That is how my tale began. Flemeth appears in other legends, helping heroes for reasons of her own. I nudge history when it's required. Other times, a shove is needed. <laughs> if Mithal is a part of you, why haven't you helped us? We've called to you, prayed to you. What was could not be changed. What about now? You know so much. You know not what you ask, child. The new Mithal and Morrigan's mother. As well as a witch who prolongs her unnatural life by possessing the bodies of her daughters. That's what you believe, is it? I found your grimoire, and I am no fool, old woman. <laughs> Yet here you stand, bound into my service. My daughter ran from me long ago. I've let her be, until now, it seems. Why did Mithal come to you? For a reckoning that will shake the very heavens. And you follow her whims. Do you even know what she truly is? You seek to preserve the powers that were, but to what end? It is because I taught you, girl. Because things happened that were never meant to happen. She was betrayed as I was betrayed, as the world was betrayed. Mithal clawed and crawled her way through the ages to me, and I will see her avenged! Alas, so long as the music plays, we dance. We summoned you because we need your help. Against the Magister who grasps beyond his reach, Yes, I know. The voices did not lie, Morrigan. I can help you fight Corypheus. Do you understand? 
child? Yes. I think I do. Wait! I wish to see who drank from the Well of Sorrows. It has been a very long time. Imagine my surprise to discover it was you. And that is all. A soul is not forced upon the unwilling, Morrigan. You were never in danger from me. All things considered, Inquisitor, I now wish you had drunk from the well. Will you be all right? I... I am uncertain. What she said is true, at least. I have the answer to your problem. I can match the Archdemon's power when the time comes. All that remains is for you to find Corypheus. Something you wanted to talk about? I read your tale of the champion, and I have a few questions. That's a pretty common reaction. Go ahead. Carry on. Inquisitor. I need to know more about Corypheus. You have waylaid all his other plans. Now, as a petulant child, he will destroy the game board rather than admit defeat. Be ready for anything. He still believes himself a god, and gods do not fall gracefully. We'll talk later. Dareth Shiran. I should go. I do rather like watching you leave. I'm listening. Anything I should know? I have nothing to report at the moment. I'll leave you to your work.
Inquisitor. Mother must be very pleased. If I see her again, I will have no choice but to do every single thing she commands. I feel certain what happened at the Temple of Mathal must somehow have been her influence. You might be right. Twas a temple dedicated to her after all. Is it a coincidence we ended up there? There must be a connection we cannot see. I suppose we have little choice but to proceed and be thankful she assisted us at all. Do you trust what Flemeth told us? About what she is? I... I am uncertain. I knew there was more to her than I realized, that she was not truly human. This? I once found her grimoire, and that was where I learned her immortality was gained by stealing the bodies of her daughters. Flemeth claims I misunderstood. It is not forced on the unwilling. Meaning I might agree to such a thing? <sighs> Impossible, yet there seemed an undeniable sense of truth to the things she told us. All my years spent hunting for arcane mysteries, and the greatest was the one I left behind. So what do you intend to do now? Once Corypheus is defeated, I will undoubtedly move on. Where I will go is uncertain. I must consider the fact that Flemeth may yet have plans for me. I am, after all, her servant. Such a delight. Yet we must now consider the coming battle. I hope all I learned from the well proves worthwhile. I'd like to know more about you. If you have questions, then ask. I'll leave you to the garden. Of course. Herald of Andraste. Can you tell me how our people are doing? What would you like to know? Do you have information on people elsewhere? The refugees in the hinterlands are desperate. Without help, starvation or war will claim many lives. With the rift near Crestwood sealed, the villagers have begun rebuilding their homes and lives. The people in the hills of Empris du Lyon are safe again, thanks to you. They may even plant crops this season. More than that I cannot say. It is a chaotic time for all in Olay and Ferelden. Farewell. Be well, Inquisitor.
Hello again. Do you have any advice for me? It's good that you recruited Entrante Vivian into the Inquisition. She is ambitious, but has always shown sense in her dealings with the Chantry. My advice would be to watch her, but heed her when she speaks. That one wastes no words. That's enough for now. Another time, then. <laughs> going well, I hope. What's been going on? Not much. The usual. Nice of you to ask. Take care. Inquisitor? Can you think of any other tasks suitable for the Chargers? Most of our people were at the Temple of Mithal. I've still got a few, though. Men who are recovering from wounds. I can send them around to rattle swords, wave flags, and look a lot larger than they are. It'll mess with enemy estimates of our numbers, and no one thinks Skyhold is undermanned. We'll talk later. How you doing? Can you tell me more about Saharon? What do you want to know? Tell me about the Tevinta people you fought. The Vince sent forces to Saharan every autumn. Guess they didn't like the summer heat. We had some good fights on the beaches, standing in knee-high water foaming red with blood, ships on fire around us. The cities were worse. Free bit of advice. Don't let the Inquisition forces get suckered into urban combat. Why do you hate to vent forces so much? What makes them so bad? It's not their armies. It's their spies. They bloodied Saharan year-round, killing loyalists, supporting rebels. Alam had no city administrator. Nobody would accept the position. The last four who held it died inside a year. Trying to conquer a country is one thing. Making it so nobody can live there? That just screws everyone. See you later, Bull. Nice talking with you, boss. Inquisitors. Oh. I see. Back, yeah? Always good. Are things playing out the way you expected? Everyone's ready to punch Corypholus in the dangle bag. <laughs> That's what you call it. Metaphor. I'll be back if I need you. Go on. Good night. Welcome we all did. They should have been born together, but instead they were bound by light. I'll talk to you later. Yes. No one to watch over, Your Worship. We either have many friends, or you've made short work of enemies.
Are you ready? Yes. And are you ready to die? You know I am. And sometimes I wonder if it isn't time to let Warden Blackwall die too. Don't concern yourself with me. I know what I owe the Inquisition. Did you need something? Is there anything I should know? Not at present. That's all for now. Should you require anything, I'll be here. Inquisitor. You're used to that by now, right? What have you learned? Did you find out about the Fade? I got a scraping that was cleaned off you, and it's weird. And the other rift bits, they're weird. It's just weird. I said weird, right? Answers, Dagna. Miriam and the Fade linked. But dwarves and tranquil? Not linked. But they were Glyrium, so they are. Somehow. And there's something there. I was face deep in a rune, and for a moment, I was tall. Really tall. <laughs> and I thought... I thought all the thoughts. <laughs> you felt taller. How much taller? Like, mountain tall. Or, I was the mountain. But I was moving. I, I felt dizzy. You know what I remembered? Watching a shaper it carve the wall of memory. Except, big. Isn't that weird? Maybe there were fumes. What do you mean when you say, thought all the thoughts? I don't know. As if, for a moment, I was around all my people. And my thought was all of theirs. Your thoughts were their thoughts? No, no, my thought was all of our thoughts. Like, parts. Ugh, words are mush. Maybe that's what the stone feels like. Or we think it feels like. If we think it feels. <laughs> Creepy. So Tranquil and Dwarves are linked to Lyrium, but also not linked. Like, the lyrium needs to flow, but if you're part of it, it takes you with it, so you can't be part of it. That makes me sad. I'm not sure why. It seems like we should be part of it, whatever it is. Or maybe we're the ones who make it happen, whatever it is. You know what's frustrating? Answers that aren't answers. Ugh. Keep investigating, and let me know what you find. I tried to make it happen again, but it wouldn't. And I had a headache. And Coco and a lie down. I'll keep at it. It's weird. Oh, and I made a rune. It's weird too. Be careful with it.
like this, who needs the view? for scalding.
Ten is mightier, Miles. 